Shalom and good day all, this is Tehillim29 back again for another DC comic review and in this review I will be reviewing Nightwing issue 84 in relation to Fear State. So looking at the covers, do the covers in any way, shape or form connect to anything that happens within the story? Well, mainly the main trade dress cover surprisingly it does so it's a big improvement there for Tom Taylor to which I gave the first cover a 7.5 out of 10 but because the next one is actually a variant I decided to give it an 8 out of 10 and as you can see there there's a bit of an idea of how much I actually pay for my comics that plus take 10% off Especially for the variants like this one. So, moving into the internal art. So, starting with some art around the beginning. And as we can see, we've got Dick Grayson in Bloodhaven about to make his way over to Gotham. Some art, of course, around the middle. And last of all, some art around the end. I must admit, I really enjoyed the art in this issue. To which I gave the art a 7 out of 10. But how does the overall story turn out in this, in my rating? Now to those who watch the channel, uh, you know that there are certain things that I personally enjoy in my storytelling. Starting off with, first things first, were there any comic references in the Fear State Nightwing? Um, I must admit, I'm a little gobsmacked. And the answer is, yes, there were some comic references in regards to this Nightwing Fear State. And I, I want to give a big thanks and shout out to Jess, who actually put in the time and editing to remember these. Um, as she made, or as they made reference to... Batman issues 112, which is something gone recent, and also Fear State, all the way up to issue 117, so pretty much everything that covers the whole arc around the Fear State. Now, were there some things missing in this? Yes, we did not get any indication of what time this was taking place. Though it would be nice to know when it was taking place, time-wise. Like, is it at 9pm at night, 10pm at night, 11pm at night, um, early in the morning, say around 1 or 2 or even 3am? None of that at all. Though it would be nice to include that. So, moving on to the next thing. What locations did we get in this? Well, a number of these locations, um, some locations were pointed out, others you had to find within the story. Um, of course, we had the main one being Bloodhaven. We had the Sky Base 01, which is connected to the Magistrate. We also had Park Row, Crime Alley, and of course the Clock Tower, but there is one more location which wasn't pointed out in there, and that was the Batman Cave system that he was using now, and it should have been pointed out. The cast of characters consisting of, of course, Nightwing, Clancy, who Nightwing caught up with before leaving Bloodhaven, and leaving Bitewing behind. Uh, Batman, of course, and Oracle, who changed into her Batgirl outfit. 
because of the improvement in this story, and I mean because of the improvement in this story, because of the comic references, it does raise the story rating up for this, um, as it did with the previous issue, and I'm glad it has. Um, if there could be more editing done in regards to what Tom Taylor is doing in, I'm going to say this, all of his stories, uh, you're going to end up with, number one, seeing continuity with his stories and where they work within the DC universe. And we need that as readers. For the rating, did I give it a 5 out of 5? No. Did I give it a 6 out of 5? Uh, 6 out of 10? No. In fact, I gave it a 7 out of 10. And the thing that actually brought it up, brought up the comic rating. Yeah, even though it might not have included the time, it was in fact the comic references that helped bring up the rating. Yes, some of the locations, uh, you know, more of them could have been pointed out in the story, uh, not just in verbal contact, but also highlighted as to, okay, this is where Dick Grayson is. It would not go astray. Well, until then, Please don't forget to hit the like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and let's keep it colourful.